Thanks for joining here, going over the 2022 Winnebago Mini. This is going to be the 2201 MB travel trailer. This unit's going to be coming in here at 26 feet. 10 inches long also going to have a dry weight of 5774 pounds this is going to be a perfect size couples coach uh, maybe even a smaller family that wants to utilize the dinette or the sofa there for sleeping space any mid-size suv smaller truck even a mid-size truck is going to be able to tow this double check of course but this is going to be a perfect unit here for mid-size vehicles going to have a big dinette on a slide and also going to have the big rear bath in it. So we're going to see how much room that opens up there in the bath. Big outdoor kitchen, also going to have a Murphy bed up front. All right, thanks for tuning in. My name's Nathan Anderson. We're going to be taking you through the 2022 Winnebago Mini. It's a 2201 MB. Right off the top here, going to have a power jack system that runs up and down right to your tow vehicle, not bending over, not cranking on anything. Also going to have two 20-pound propane tanks. Auto switchover valve is included in there. Battery disconnect, also complete with a battery box, keeping that battery out of the uh, any of the elements and a full fiberglass front nose cap, complete with lights. Now out of the side of the coach here, you guys are going to have a complete pass-through storage. Normally, on a normal manufacturer, you would only have this. They like to cut it back into here. Tons and tons of storage if you guys are going to be doing any traveling, small family, even a couple's coach that has a lot of stuff. You guys are going to appreciate that a lot. Also over here, you guys are going to have a big grab handle on the entry door, complete with a nice aluminum step. That way it's not rotting or rusting anytime during the uh, duration you guys might own this. Over here, you guys are going to have a uh, cable inlet, outlet. You guys are going to have a, a 110 outlet. That's going to be for a, a TV, et cetera, if you guys are going to be doing any tailgating. Gonna appreciate that. Over here, one thing I forgot to bring up, nice magnetic uh, closure here holder on the door. Normally, you would have a, a little black clip. Those like to break, get a little brittle, hot, cold weather. Don't have to worry about that. Keep it up out of the way. Nice mini fridge, nice uh, prep storage, flat surface here. Hot, cold knobs on a stainless steel faucet. And this is like a gray stone. It's like a black stone, cold rolled steel. Um, cooktop, treat it just like you would like a Blackstone, nice for breakfast, any, pretty much any dinner throughout the day. Now the back of this unit, gonna be uh, completely prepped with the Voyager site technology from the manufacturer. Nice window here if you're laying in a bunk and have a nice view out in the morning. Also gonna have a uh, spare tire, complete with the holder. Nice uh, rear bumper, do a clamp on style, like a two inch receiver if you need to install a bike rack or anything. Over here on the side, all of your generalized satellite hookups, park cable hookups, all your uh, holding tank uh, levers here to empty the tanks. Going to have your black tank flush too. That's going to be where you plug the uh, water hose in at, flush all of that black tank out. No need to, you know, put a wand down the toilet, anything like that anymore. Also going to have your retract and extend buttons for the power jacks on this camper. Also, the outdoor shower, hot and cold knobs, maybe spray out big pots and pans, maybe a muddy dog. All right, now to the interior here. Gonna have an his and her cabinet style setups. These will be complete with a hanger for uh, any hangers, hang up any garments. Tons of overhead storage, his and her night lights. You guys can press the button on the center there, pick which ones you wanna turn off with the button. Also, tons of storage you'll notice on both sides of the bed. Perfect. A lot of people might have CPAPs, sleeping machines, charging any devices right there. Then there will be a curtain located. Have a nice little privacy if you have anybody sitting over there in the bunk area. All right, now the dinette here. Perfect size. Wrap the whole family around there. Wrap your friends around there. Going to have a lot of storage underneath it. That storage will go to the end here. Fit nice little storage container for any organization. This will drop flat. Cushions go on top of it, perfect to lounge, to watch a movie maybe. Another small doll could spend the night. Over here to the entertainment center, going to have lots of storage here for movies, DVDs, tons of uh, options here as far as what speakers you guys want to play music through, Bluetooth capability, going to have your Dometic, um, that's going to be a nice electronic thermostat, nice TV, 
Winnebago's do come with TV, something not a lot of manufacturers provide anymore. We'll have a wireless charging pad, throw your phone on that, charge it, lots of storage underneath. Again, Blu-ray players, DVDs. Over here, we'll have your Dometic, that's gonna be your eight cubic foot gas and electric fridge. So boondockers, you guys can run that fridge going down the road, run it when you guys don't have electric hookups. Over here, you have the Furion Speed Cook. Um, that's gonna be a convection and normal standard microwave. You guys don't have the oven, that microwave will do everything an oven does. Over here, we'll have a glass style cooking surface that will lift up, protect the black splash. That way you guys are uh, cleaning stuff up off that, not off the back here. We'll have lots of storage underneath where the oven would be at. Storage underneath the sink here, complete with covers. Nice farmhouse style, stainless style sink here. Put the covers back on. That's a drying rack. That's more storage for the uh, more flat storage. And that will have a pull down, spray out big pots and pans there. Now the rear bath on this style camper. This floor plan, the rear bath, tons of space, tons of storage space, tons of overall um, space that you guys can use. Um, especially a couple two people can easily get ready in this bathroom here don't see that a lot we'll have a skylight over the tub that's four to six inches of headroom if you're a taller person stainless steel hardware and all of the shower and then this will pull close nice shower enclosure it's just not a cheap curtain that will um, let a bunch of water out so to say all of this complete whole wall of storage those storage goes all the way back to the wall of the camper. Tons and tons of room there. We'll have a nice medicine cabinet here complete with a mirror. Storage on the inside, outside of those. Storage all the way to the back. And again, something Winnebago does not cheap out. Normally you put, see a cheap uh, bowl of a sink here, cheap faucet, that's stainless steel. Complete with 110 outlets, hair dryer, hair blower, etc., And storage underneath the sink also. Thanks for tuning in here today. Again, my name's Nathan Anderson. Pleasure uh, showing you guys around here on the Winnebago Mini. I can be reached here at Team Anderson, 937-649-5823.